stage. Here, backstage, behind the big speakers, the stars came out too, and they had an awful lot to say. I'm here because I feel like millions of people feel around the world that something has to be done about uh, the arms race, the madness that's going on. We are simply sending the message that if we are the people, and this is what this country is, want to hear our voice? There it is. That's our voice. And we're saying, nuclear freeze. It's only regrettable that they can't have a comparable uh, uh, protest in uh, Moscow because they had a few people there today. I told, I'm told they were arrested. Regrettable. But the people in the Soviet Union want what the people in the United States want. They want to give peace a chance. It's not important that Reagan hears or the politician hears. It's important that the grandmas and the grandpas and the unemployment and the woman with the baby in her belly. And when they hear it, then the politicians jump in line. I think in the 60s, it was, it was an idea. It was, it, was, it was more like a concept, but it didn't seem to have the, the kind of tangible you know, edge of, of terror that it has now. And people are really starting to understand that we're, we're hostages of these weapons, you know, and they, they want out from under it. Yeah.